Okay, so we are about to show you the operation of the Select Division stereo video disc player that we have brought back from the dead. And here to tell you all about it is Digital Dave. We will be inserting Zero, the gay blade. When the unit has the L, it's indicating load. And it has to go in on this little slant. Um, and once you get it in the grooves, it'll take over on its own. So what's happening is it released the uh, disc from its main sheet. Now it's going to drop down and start playing. Uh, due to the age and the you know the record, you have a little wobble now. Here's the old 20th century fox. So we're kind of excited because when we got this machine, it had a disc stuck in it and wasn't doing much of anything. We're actually getting uh, getting it to play now, thanks to our friends at uh, Back Porch Video in Atlanta. And if you can see here, this is actually how it's reading it. This bar will move across slowly reading the disc. And actually, just like the uh, record, there's a side one and a side two. So at a certain point, it'll request you to flip it over. And you have to slide it back in, turn it over, and reload it. So you were telling me about some warpage on the platter. You'll see how it's, you know, you see the disc, how it's wobbling. There's a plastic platter underneath that has warped over time. And, you know, there's a good chance that the disc has warped a little too, which is giving you the little skipping in the actual film. Uh, we can try over time weighing the, you know, getting a good balance by adding weights to the platter, but I'm not entirely sure if we want to try that here. Really, it might snap the platter. And to eject it, just hit reject. Slide in the case slowly. And once it has it, it'll take it, lock it in, and you can pull it out. Voila. Once again, 